I recently made a TikTok video about the LG mask and that video kind of blew up. A lot of you guys wanted to know more about this, so here it is. Everything you need to know about the LG PureCare wearable air purifier. So for those of you who don't know, this isn't just a mask. It's a wearable air purifier that constantly purifies the air no matter where you are. But let's quickly get started with what you get in the box. You obviously get the face mask itself, instruction manuals, two H13 grade HEPA filters, the face guard, 15 pieces of the inner cover, you get a strap extender, a suede portable pouch, and the charging cable, which is USB Type-C. Love to see it. Now right away, something that I noticed is the fact that the mask is quite light, way lighter than I was expecting going into this. It's just about 94 grams. Now let's set this guy up. The process is quite simple. Step one, open the filter case and place the filter inside. Close it until you hear a click. Insert the inner cover using the provided guides. You can wash the face guard and attach it using the magnets at the back. Lastly, you can turn the mask on by pressing and holding on the power button. Once it's turned on, there's a little LED at the bottom that'll show you the power level and that it is turned on. Quite simply, press down the button. There we hear a beep and now the mask is on. You can hear the fans kick in. Now, if I press this button again, you hear a double click and the microphone is turned on. More on this a little bit later. So going on about the build quality and the design, like I said, it's a lot lighter than expected. At the bottom, you have the USB Type-C port to charge up the device. At the front, you've got the voice own microphone unit, so your voice is very well heard. At the bottom, you've got the air exhalation valve, which prevents fogging when you breathe. And lastly, the fans are built on the inside, controlled by your breathing. Now remember the inner filters I mentioned? The purpose of that is to reduce air leakage and even little particles or spit particles that fall out of your mouth. And there's 15 replacement units in there. This is recommended to be changed daily for the best, most hygienic use. Lastly, you've got the strap extender and I use this the entire time because my hair is very thick at the back and just putting it on with the ear straps, it wouldn't really attach properly. Now let's talk usability and performance. Since this is electronic, you have the respiratory sensors built in. These sensors are able to recognize your breathing pattern and how heavily you're breathing and adjust the fan speed based on that. The dual fans are able to blow the air out through the vent based on your breathing pattern. So if you're running and jogging and you're breathing a lot quicker, the air is going to be pushed out a lot quicker to avoid fogging up or moisture being built up. This results in constantly breathing in fresh feeling air thanks to the HEPA filters, no heat built up, reduced moisture and no fogging. If you wear glasses like I do, this is absolutely perfect. The voice on technology on this works really well and it's able to project your voice using that microphone output and anyone can hear you pretty well regardless of if you're outdoors, in a group or on a phone call. You can get up to 8 hours of usage time based on a single charge which is about 2 hours from 0 to 100%. There's also a Bluetooth application coming for this very soon, which will help make this a little bit more convenient for people. You'll be allowed to measure things like your filter management, time of usage, air intake, respiratory rate, and a lot more. Now let's go over the pros and the cons on this. Firstly, I can't explain this, but the air you breathe feels very clean. I know this sounds stupid, but hear me out. When you're using a regular mask and breathing in and out constantly, after a while, you're kind of breathing your same stale air and it feels a bit gross. With the LG mask, on the other hand, I constantly had that feeling of fresh air coming through. It felt almost like the air conditioning was turned on with a filter. So it felt like constant fresh air coming through and I definitely do like that. The second pro on this would be that all of these parts are separately sold as well. So you can get easy replacement parts to constantly use this to give you the best experience with the cleanest and the most hygienic usage. Finally, if you're into working out a lot, this is definitely a plus for you because of that constant adjustment of fan speed based on your breathing. So if you're running, you're jogging, you're lifting weights, whatever it is, your breath is all controlled and the way the ventilation works is based on your breath. As for the cons, this may be a very personal pain point, but this wasn't necessarily the most comfortable mask I've worn, regardless of a cloth mask or an electronic mask. Uh, I kind of feel like even though it's quite light, uh, for my nose structure and because of my hair being quite thick, it pulled down a lot and put weight on my nose and my ears downward. So I was constantly forced to use the strap without which 
it either wouldn't stay on comfortably or it would keep slipping down. So not really the best, even in spite of the adjustment provided for my nose and face tap, I guess, it's not the most comfortable face mask. I did speak to other creators about this and they said that it was quite comfortable for them. So again, I think this is just me, but I have to mention it. The second con, I guess, on this could be the management and cost. Now, obviously the device itself is already quite expensive, but on top of that, you'll have a monthly cost of replacing the inner filters at least twice in a month and the main filters every single month. So these are set for one month based on six to eight hours of usage daily. So yeah, replacement can get quite expensive. Now I would personally recommend this mask to people who work out a lot and need to have a mask on during that time period. Or you're located in a very air polluted area where the air isn't very clean when you move around. And lastly, maybe just if you're very health conscious, it just makes sense to have this because you're constantly assured that you're breathing in the best air that you can. But otherwise, for most everyday people who don't care about all of that stuff, I really can't recommend this product. It's an additional cost, monthly reoccurring cost as well, and it's another device that you need to charge up, which a lot of people don't really like. But anyway, that's everything you need to know about the LG PuriCare wearable air purifier. Really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, a like would be appreciated, and I'll see you again in the next video. Until then, 